The SS Luray Victory was the 17th Victory ship, a new 10,500-ton class ship built during World War II. The California Shipbuilding Company built the ship under the Emergency Shipbuilding Program. She was launched on May 11, 1944, and completed on June 26, 1944. The ship's United States Maritime Commission designation was VC-2SAP-3, hull number 17, V-17. The SS Luray Victory served in the Pacific Ocean during World War II and was operated by the Mississippi Shipping Company. Victory ships were designed to replace the outdated Liberty ships. They would last longer and be able to serve the U.S. Navy after World War II. The Victory ships differed from Liberty ships in that they were longer, wider, taller and faster. Victory ships had a thin stack set closer to the superstructure and had a long raised foc'sle. The SS Luray Victory was named after the city of Luray, Virginia, one of the 218 Victory ships named after an American city. She was launched at the yards of the California Shipbuilding Corporation in Wilmington, Los Angeles on May 11, 1944. The ship was the 17th in a long line of Victory ships, many of which were built at the California Shipbuilding Corporation, Calship, Yard. Her engines were built by the Joshua Handy Iron Works in California. During World War II, the SS Luray Victory operated in the Pacific Ocean bringing supplies to the U.S. and the Allies. On November 30, 1944, the SS Luray Victory reached New Guinea. The ship was part of Convoy GB-720 which carried supplies to forces fighting in the Battle of Leyte and the Battle of Okinawa. From June 26, 1945 to August 15, 1945, she prepared for Operation Downfall the invasion of the Japanese home islands with exercises at Leyte. When Japan surrendered on August 15, 1945, the exercises were cancelled. In January of 1946, the SS Luray Victory departed Baltimore, Maryland. She was transporting grain to Bremerhaven, Germany as part of the Marshall Plan. She crossed the Atlantic Ocean at a speed near her maximum 16.5 knots. In the night of January 30, 1946, the SS Luray Victory entered the Straits of Dover. She had no local maritime pilot on board and was steaming too fast and too close to the shore. The ship ran aground at Goodwin Sands, off the coast of Deal, Kent, England. She hit the sandbank hard and the engines stopped. By 9 p.m. the chief engineer had informed the captain that the engines were unable to be repaired. The captain of the ship sent a radio distress signal to the Coast Guard. At 10.27 p.m. the Coast Guard found the ship. A rescue could not be made until morning due to a low tide and rough seas. On the morning of January 31, 1946, the rescue tugs, HMS Lady Bassi in Persia tried to free the ship but the attempt was abandoned due to gale force winds. At 4 p.m., the Coast Guard returned to find the SS Luray Victory breaking up and realized salvage was impossible. The 49 crew abandoned the ship, moved ashore by Freddie Upton, the lifeboat captain. The top part of the shipwreck was visible for 50 years at 51LL04N, 0013162. On December 24, 1946, the SS Northeastern Victory was also wrecked on the Goodwin Sands. 